Well, transitioning from military service into the civilian life can be hard for many veterans. The gym owner in Tuscola saw the need for a safe space for vets, and he filled it. He started a group designed to help veterans deal with the changes of life after the military. WCI3's Ariana Williams is with us. So how did this new space come about? It started with the owner and other veterans hanging out every week. When he saw the effect it was having on the men, he knew he needed to do more. It's a platoon, it's a squad, it's a company again, you know, it's, everybody's that close. It's a group dedicated to veterans trying to find their place in everyday life. They travel from all over Douglas County to meet here once a week. The meeting started at a pub until they decided they needed a bigger space. Let's try to do it on a scale way bigger than just Tuscola. Um, and that's when we started putting in the work and the hours and talking and ha just having conversations. The barracks is where members talk to people who understand what they've been going through. The hardest thing when you come back is, you know, just not even deployment, but just military in general. It's finding that, that, that structure, that, that stability that you had with your guys. When moving on from the military, many veterans fall into depression, experience substance abuse, and can even lead to an unstable social life. Edward says with 217 Vets, they address the risk of suicide by reinstilling camaraderie. When people get out of the military, they don't miss the kicking in doors or shooting guns or anything like that. 99% of the time, they just miss the people. And it's those relationships keeping veterans coming back. He kind of opened the doors, you know, for really any veteran to come in. And I kind of took advantage of that, and I've been here ever since. And, you know, they've become a, a family to me. While the group does provide traditional services for veterans, Edwards says it was important to make it feel like a lounge. He says these connections keep veterans going. And it's a breath of fresh air for, for veterans, I feel like, and this is something that we've needed for a long time. The group will be partnering with Grunt Style to host a fundraising event for veterans in the area that will be taking place in Tuscola on the 27th. Back to you. All right, Ariana, thank you.